I am bringing the Simbis Gecko multifocal and EDOF lens menu to your tables. We all know that when it comes to talking to our patients about uh, lens replacement surgery for presbyopia correction, there is always a difficult conversation involved because they wonder how the vision will be after treatment. And for us as clinicians, it's difficult to, to manage their expectations properly sometimes. And we are not always capable to work out whether they will be a happy patient after surgery or not. As clinicians, we typically wonder which of the countless intraocular lens options, combinations, refractive targets will suit our patients best. And of course, patients want to make sure that they are making the right choice for the rest of their lives out of the very extensive lens menu that they are being presented with. According to the latest paper published by Rampart and Gatinel, there were close to 100 different intraocular lens options in the market in 2020. So this is the reason why Simbis Gecko was developed, as it represents a revolutionary technology that offers a personalized and accurate experience of premium presbyopic corrections to patients before intraocular lens implantation. The extensive menu included in Symbius Gecko allows us to choose which lenses we want our patients to taste. And this is really interesting because we can see how is the performance of different technologies for the same subject. As you can see, we have a significant number of different types of intraocular lens simulations already available in the device with different optical principles and properties such as monofocal plus or enhanced monofocal, extended for focus or increased range of focus lenses, bifocal, straight focus with a full range of focus and from very different manufacturers as well. This is a patient that has tasted seven different lenses and we can see their performance at all distances. This particular subject has very similar performance at far and intermediate for all lenses, but important differences across lenses are near. But this is just the example of one subject. Here we have two other different subjects that were shown the same lenses through Simbis Gecko, but the performance was different for each of them. For subject 5, on the left of the screen, the intermediate vision with the extended f of focus intraocular lens we can, that we can see in red was better compared to the monofocal simulation in black, whereas the trifocal intraocular lenses tested provided better visual acuity at near distance compared to the extended f of focus. On the contrary, subject number one on the right presents a naturally increased f of focus as can be seen from the monofocal simulation in black and this also has an impact on the rest of the simulations, so there are no significant differences in performance between the different lenses. To finalize, I would like to say that with Simbis Gecko, we can not only simulate multifocal and either of intraocular lenses, but also LASIK presbyopic patterns and multifocal contact lenses. As you just saw, Simbis Gecko can accurately predict the performance of different intraocular lenses in cases of clear crystalline lenses, but there are also some clinical studies that demonstrate its usefulness in patients with mild to moderate cataracts. And all of this is done through a non-invasive personalized assessment.